Carlin, um, she passed out again. Hi, babe. Hi, babe. Okay, friends, this is exciting. I don't know what to say. I don't, I don't know what to do. I think I'm gonna have a baby. <laughs> Look at us. <laughs> I felt cool, babe. You are cool, babe. We're in triage. So I guess this is where they monitor, figure out if I'm actually in labor or not. Yeah. Guess how many centimeters I already am. I'm five and a half. <laughs> <laughs> almost six. And they said, yeah, you're, you're for sure in labor. Years. So for sure in labor, so yeah. she's telling my doctor right now. <laughs> so we are not going home tonight. Lord willing, we're having a baby. We're doing it! Okay guys, um, a lot has happened in the last like 30 minutes. Uh, some scary things, some crazy things. So first of all, we told you she's being admitted. The nurses came in and did everything with her. She's already got her IV, but Carlin doesn't really do needles too well. And when she got the IV, she got very weak, very dizzy, and she pretty much passed out. Um, she was kind of like unresponsive. I was trying to talk to her. One of the nurses was trying to talk to her. And uh, she was like unresponsive for a while. And then they finally got her up to go in the wheelchair and she like almost fell over. So it was a little bit creepy. Um, she's doing a lot better now, but you can see she's still, she's still kind of out of it. Kind of worried me for a little bit, but I think she's doing fine. Um, and they've got us in a room now. So this is where baby boy is going to be coming. And then Obviously from then we'll go to another room. I think, they don't leave you in the same room, right? I'm trying to remember, I've only had one kid. We go to another room, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, so we should be going into another room. Your bed? No. Oh, the baby bed. I'll have to show you the baby bed. It's so cute. It's adorable. Baby boy's gonna be right there in just a little bit. Am I ready? Babe, you are so ready. Am I ready? You are so strong. You're more ready than anybody I know. I don't know if I'm ready. I thought I was so ready. I know you're ready. And now I don't know if I'm ready. You're beyond ready. You're so strong. And I remember that feeling holding Layla. It was like the best feeling. I know, and you're about to have that feeling again. I think I'm crying. I think you are. I know you are. <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm glad. Me too, baby. I'm so excited. Me too. I know. Contraction. She said she was gonna get me baby medicine. Yeah. Can you see it on the monitor? Um, yeah, I can either see your heart rate or the contraction. <laughs> Or both. I think it's two different things. No, dude, that's my contraction right there. This one down here? That huge one. This one up here? Yeah. You're supposed to freak out. I feel cool. I'm freaking out, babe. You're amazing. Dear Jesus, we thank you for this day and your many blessings, Lord. We pray that you'll guide Carlin safely through this delivery and baby boy safely out at all, Lord. Just be with us as we're here, Lord. Give her the grace and strength and wisdom she needs to get through this, Lord. And guide us along the way and be with her the whole way, Lord. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. All right. It is about 2.15. Carlin is now on a exercise ball. <laughs> it's a birthing ball and it feels so much better. Yeah, she loves right sitting on those. She says it feels a lot better. She's gonna give me some pain meds. Or is, does that excite you? A little bit. She's excited oh, about yeah, the pain meds. Girl. It's now 2.15. I'm trying to update my mom. My sister's my best friend. I'm a little dizzy though. Well, don't go falling off the ball. This is just crazy. I don't, don't know what to expect. Like, is it gonna go fast? Is it gonna go slow? I don't know. Who knows at this point? <laughs> I 
I got ice chips in school. There you go. How are you doing? I'm doing good. I'm just along for the ride. Okay, Carlin passed out again. <laughs> she was on the exercise ball and the nurse was in here and I was standing behind her and um, they gave her some pain medicine through her IV and she told her it could make her a little dizzy within a few minutes. But within like 30 seconds, Carlin was literally, she had her phone in her hand cause she was FaceTiming her sister and she just like dropped the phone and she started to go. And so me and the nurse grabbed her and then we put her back in the bed and uh, she was unresponsive again for a couple minutes. So she keeps scaring me with that. So <laughs> we're gonna really keep an eye on her. Um, I mean, she's still breathing and everything's going well when that happens, but it's still scary. I don't like to see it. So <sighs> lots of uh, roller coaster vibes here in the last hour or two. So I've been thinking about you the whole time. I know. It's almost time. You're gonna have that little baby. I gotta be getting close. I just wish I could get my head under her. I'm scared I'm not gonna get it. Transition is from seven centimeters to ten centimeters. You're at six. But my water broke. hasn't broke. It did break? It didn't. It didn't? No. But I'm ready yeah. for some pain medicine. I miss you. I miss you so much. Mm -hmm. Oh, I mm -hmm. love that you called, though. I feel like I'm right there with you. It's weird. I keep passing out. It's a really weird feeling. And then it's just like, I feel good for a second. Okay, friends, we got a big update. Somebody's happy. I finally got my epidural. <laughs> I can't even tell you. They didn't even give me my epidural until I was eight centimeters. Yeah, they waited a while waiting on blood work or something. Yeah. Because he said it was low. And so by the time she was like eight centimeters, she was like just now getting it and it was just crazy. So I can't imagine. But the cool Lord brought us through it. Really? She I was asking. Want to do it again, but it was cool. She was Maybe saying. Like a super she was like, "Maybe I should try natural." And then, as she was doing all this, she was like, "I'm so glad I didn't do natural." <laughs> but it does. I mean, she really is a superwoman. I can't believe she handled all that pain. You're amazing. She's been doing all those contractions by herself. So there's finally some ease. Well, the reason I couldn't get my epidural sooner was because. First off, I came in when I was almost six centimeters. And then they had to do blood work to see if my levels were low. Something they have to check before they can give me the epidural. So they were waiting on those results to come back. So I just had to sit in here and do the waiting game. But they were getting pretty intense, like super intense. It is 3.37. So she got the epidural, got her IV. The other sad news though, she does have to get a second IV because they found out she is anemic and just for some blood purposes or something, they need a second some, IV. Some, if something goes wrong with blood or do you need to get yeah. blood or something? Something like that, yeah. So I have to do my She said the IV for her is like worse than the epidural, worse than like anything. She hates it. So now she's got to get a second one. So that's sad. But the good thing is she's going through big contractions right now and not feeling like anything. So. Finally. He gave me an extremely light dose because I don't handle like medicine very well. We found that out tonight for sure. Like not at all. I have passed out like I think like five or six times already. Maybe five. How many times? It's a lot. I don't know. Like I keep passing out. Which might be because I'm anemic. But also the last time she got her epidural with Layla, her legs and feet kind of started going numb as well. Yeah. Like right now, I can totally yeah. like, I can totally like lift up my leg. Yeah. Move, like I still feel like pressure and everything, but mm -hmm. it's not the like super Yeah, crazy. she started kind of like going crazy when she couldn't feel her legs last time. It was so weird for her. So this time's very So nice. I asked him to give me like the lightest dose and he can up it, yeah. but it feels so much So better. it's going well. So now it's the waiting game. We can like rest and chill. I call my mom. 
She's so sweet. All my sisters, they all sit there praying. My whole family's praying. Lots of people to update. It's hard to believe. It really is. I know. I'm so excited. So now we're gonna shut the lights off, see if we can get any shut eye before they come back in to do the IV and move forward, so. Okay, so who is it? Yeah. We're I just. Walk? Yeah. Okay. First off, they had to do me second IVs. They did it twice there, once there, and over here, and dug around a lot and couldn't get an IV. Carlin yet. has very bad pains, and they could not get the second one in yet. If I wouldn't have been in so much pain, I would have been uh, videoing all the times Evan took a nap and said that he needed a nap. I would have done You wouldn't have had much footage. <laughs> She acts like I was asleep for so long. But I literally kept calling his phone, like, wake up. Dude. Oh, yeah, she was calling me. I'm literally like 10 feet from her on a couch, and my watch starts ringing, and I'm like, Carla, here's the thing. I slept, I would say, probably only an hour or two total. Yes. Three. No, I don't think so. Fine. Two and a half See? hours. And it was just in the time where she was continuing to transition, and they said, y'all get some rest. We'll come back in and keep checking you. So I was like, okay. I took them up on it. So much. They strength. were trying to put a second IV in her arm. Um, and she does have pretty bad veins. And they could not find it. And so she was in pain of them trying to get an IV. Because IVs hurt her more than like anything for some reason. She hates those. I psyched myself out. So poor her. I was asleep. I didn't know that. And that's why she was calling me because she was in pain. So I do feel bad for missing that. I didn't know anything big was going to happen. So I thought I'd get a little nap in. But on a good note. I'm nine centimeters. Yeah, it could be any minute now. And I'm actually starting to feel a lot, which is uncomfortable. Yeah. And actually one of the nurses noticed something when she was checking me. So she's actually going to get the doctor to make sure everything's okay. So keep it Yeah, we'll see what that is. What? Nothing. You're cute. I need to do something with my hair. You need me to fix it? I mean, you might have to. I don't think I fix hair good, but I can try. Got so much stuff on me. I'm not supposed to fix it. <laughs> I'll Maybe do it. Maybe like a braid or something? Yeah. I don't know. Oh, I got it. Yeah. I don't even have a hair bow. Our bags are in the car. Yeah, I know. We never got them. I know. I thought we'd wait till we got in our own room. Like after this. Update, it is 5.02. Yep. All right, sweet girl, big breaths. You can do this, okay? There you go, Carla. You're okay. Breathe, baby, breathe. Yes, ma'am. I can't breathe. There you go. There you go. Okay. Carlin started to progress very fast and she was progressing faster than her epidural was giving her medicine. So, so she started actually having like legit pains, practically like having those contractions on your own. Um, so the doctor and all of them kind of rushed in and they were trying to Give the anesthesia to give her more medicine and try and get it in time. Because, I mean, at this he point, you're at like, room. yeah, and you're at like nine, nine and a half centimeters, they said. No, and she was like, no, she was like, you're ready to push. But yeah. I want, I don't want you to have to push without. Right. Like it, your dose. Yeah. And I was like, I don't want it either. Please yeah. Don't. So <laughs> she was in immense pain. He came in, gave her some medicine. It didn't obviously kick in for a few minutes. So she was still in immense pain. He was wanting to come back and give her more or something, I think. And so she started feeling a little bit, but it was still not enough and it was still very painful. And by this point, the doctor was like, your baby's coming out. So he came back in, gave her some more medicine. 
praise the Lord, it kicked in right before they did Literally, start pushing. Right as they were like, you got to push. She it stopped feeling the contraction. Like, so it was like, like, I still definitely felt yeah. things going on, yeah. but it was not, not like it was. near as painful. Like, yeah. it took the edge I off I can't of imagine. It. And I was just like, so that was a little scary at the end because I knew she was in immense pain. Really, it pushes away from having him. Okay. Oh, I know so. He, this baby's low. Gosh, I really love y'all. We love you too. You're doing amazing. <laughs> you are. This is tough stuff. Okay. You're doing awesome. You're killing it, babe. You are. You are not gonna tell I think it'd be a good idea to be ready. Yeah, I do. You're a superhero, babe. Come You're so strong, I love you. We're having a baby though. <laughs> I love you. I love you. Thanks for being here. Of course, baby. Oh, I'm gonna drink a gallon of water after this. <laughs> because you're gonna really pull those to you. Okay. Take that big breath in. And curl around baby and push in your bottom. Push, 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 push. Yes, 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 yeah. yes. Beautiful, beautiful. Keep going, keep going. All right, girly, breathe. So good. Wow, So babe. good. Okay, big breath in. He's moving. He is moving. You're not gonna push long at all. <laughs> really? <laughs> all right, girl. Big breath in. And go, all on your bottom, push, 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 push. Yes, 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 perfect, 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 perfect. Five, six, seven. I'm telling you, I could not have made it without no. the nurses, like, during those contractions, like, putting pressure on my back. I mean, Oh, I, they were doing whatever they could to help her. They were so they sweet. They were so sweet. They were so encouraging. So yeah. I was so thankful for such a good experience. They did such a good job. One wow, more time, babe, big breath you in. are killing it. <laughs> <laughs> Breath in and go on your bottom. Push, 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 push. One, two, three, four. More, 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 more. Good, good. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> All right, sweetie. We're gonna rest until that next contraction, okay? Wow, babe. You can see her leg over. Put it down. It's you are okay. killing it. <laughs> you're, you're. Is he's? I love you. He's gonna be here in no time. I'm so excited. <laughs> this is my favorite part. Me too. All of your training has prepared you for this moment. <laughs> what training? Nine months. <laughs> yeah, it's way worse. I'd honestly probably do a day of contractions over. Nine right, girl, months. Big of breath in, okay. There you go. We're just getting baby a little bit of extra oxygen. When you push, it just squeezes him a little bit. It's the best day of our lives. I know. <laughs> Did you guys decide on a name or still don't know yet? We got a middle name. It's Patrick. Oh, I love it. First name, we're pretty sure, but we have to see him first. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> All right, girl. Here's a contraction. Okay. You ready? Tell me when. All right. Big breath in. And go. On your bottom. Push, 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 push. Yes, yes, yes. Go, so go, 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 go. Five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I get Good job. Right ahead. Okay. Big breath in. Big breath in. You're Breathe. okay. You're okay. All right, you don't have to let her back. Yeah. She's just, I had a feeling she's very sensitive um, to pressure changes. Hey, 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 hey. Carlin. Thank you. Okay, baby. You're okay. You're I'm okay. I'm going to get the smelling salts for her, I think. I'm going to step out and get that. As she was pushing, she kind of did that right there. She was kind of passing tired. out. Um, she passed out multiple times last night. Like the doctors even had like, they were telling each nurse and like, I think it was on her chart, like passes out easily. And she's never really done this. I don't really like that. Yeah, she, she, she did pass out one time with Layla when she got up to go to the bathroom with a nurse last time. And they had to break that thing and let her smell it and it brought her back. But that's only like once in your life pretty much. But last night she was passing out multiple times when she got her IV the epidural she was like going out of it and they were like carlin carlin having to wake her up so i was kind of freaking out i didn't know if that was like bad or I what was going still on here y'all yeah like screaming at me but i was like like my body wouldn't do it yeah it wouldn't like i couldn't just do what they were telling me it yeah was so weird. it was weird and that was lie. scary it was weird but it actually felt kind of cool 
it was like the one, out. yeah because it was like like a factory I, reset it was like, i actually can relax because yeah I, I was so tense like it was weird it's like yeah. i was on a cloud for just a little bit <laughs> well praise the lord they got her back and she got to push in and she didn't even it was kind of like last this part was kind of like layla's birth it was like five minutes of pushing like both of her deliveries have been very quick this one was just a lot worse because she actually felt a lot of the contractions oh, so for I real. This pain with Layla. I'm gonna go a little shorter. Let's do it. <sighs> all right, girl, just to five. Big breath in and go. Give it all you got, just for five seconds. One, two, it. three, four, five. All right, Carlin. Great. Carlin, this is, this is here, he's so close, baby. Hey, babe. No. Okay. Wait. Just deep breaths, baby. Deep okay. breaths. I'll do it. I like the way they smell. Yeah. Oh, really? I know. It's weird. Hey, baby. Carlin, he's right there. He is right there. I feel like I'm out of it. You're good, babe. You're good, babe. I don't want to miss it. No, you're not missing it. You're right here. Hey. Hey, look at me. I can't remember what's happening. Hey. You don't have to remember. <laughs> you're right here. You're right here. Be in the he, moment. Okay? Yeah. You're yeah. Work. You're about to hold your baby boy. That's what you're about to have happen. And we gave you a little bit of warm blanket because you were shivering a little bit. That's the epidural. But you're, but it just matters how your body you're okay. Yes. Okay. Do you want to do skin to skin? Okay. I'm just going to unbutton your gown a little bit. Oh, it'd be so nice. So we're just going to do some short pushes, but I need to push hard when you push, okay? And we're just going to do them in three seconds and then let off. So okay. hopefully that here. That way you don't kind of lose it, okay? okay. You got this. Good care, baby. Almost done. I'm so glad the epidemic picked Yeah, praise the Lord. That will work out perfect. Here we go. Yeah, I feel it. Tell me when. And now you can go one, two, three, four, five. Okay, three. Something. Yeah, that's the head. <laughs> oh, little, little baby. Push and he's yeah. gonna be here. Another little push. Yeah. There you go. Look at this sweet hello, yes. buddy. Oh, wow, baby. Little push for me. Yeah, I know. That's what's holding me. Oh, wow. Oh, Josh. Oh, Josh. Oh, 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 so gorgeous. You're so, so precious. precious. <laughs> You're amazing. You're oh, so he's strong. So you can put it like on that. Okay. You're so cute. Yeah. Yeah. Are you okay if I clamp this cord? Do you know? Whatever you need. Okay. Let's see. Pull off the side for me. Oh, what a cutie. You are very cute. Over on this side. Oh, oh Carla. Oh. I'm so proud of you. You're so amazing. <laughs> when you finally, like, lay him on your chest. Yeah. It's just, like, so worth it. Yeah. Like, I can't explain. It's, like, the best feeling in the world. I wish I could do it over and over and over again. Carlin, I'm so impressed. That was amazing. <laughs> Thank you so much. I could have done it without all of y'all. <laughs> you are so sweet. We literally had the best nurses, yeah. the best doctor, the best anesthesiologist. Like everything was like so perfect. Yeah. We it couldn't have like been more perfect. They were so Everybody sweet. was so nice. And
My belly feels smaller. <laughs> yeah, you're not even gonna look pregnant. Yeah, oh you're so cool. Oh my goodness, I'm so happy. Yeah. Oh my word. Oh yeah, he's pinky. Oh, oh my word. He is. Wow. <laughs> yeah. What was the time? Fourteen. Cool. 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 Yeah, she knows. <laughs> He's so beautiful. He's there. I'm so proud of you. I know. You're so amazing. You're the best. He's wow, you literally him. pushed like for five minutes. Like, I don't even know if it was five minutes. It may not have been. <laughs> oh my god, he is so precious. He's like, he is. Look at his cheeks. Oh my word. <laughs> We're gonna die. I'm so in love. <laughs> pretty sure I'm in heaven. You see, I'm pretty sure you're gonna have another? No, I'm gonna have another one. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. Were you saying no earlier? Yes. <laughs> yes. Y'all are doing great. I feel like the medicine kicked in right, literally right before I started pushing it, finally kicked in. I, feel so I know, he got you good. I'm glad. It was a miracle. Okay, I'm going in with my guess at seven pounds, eight ounces. I'm going at seven ten. We haven't weighed him yet. Yep. Our nurse thinks seven, seven four. Seven four. Anybody else want to weigh in on a guess? I picked him up. I got to take him well, okay, because she picked him up, up, so I don't know. She might have an advantage there. Oh, five, eight. Five, eight. Wow. He's five, eight. Yeah. Wow. Really? Way off. Turn towards me a little bit. <laughs> I know you want to look at Dad. That's right. Yeah. Made him. Yeah, you're like, what's her uh, she's... Oh, she's so cute. Yeah. Twenty inches long. Twenty inches. So he measured twenty inches long. Um, and the weight, they said he was five pounds, eight ounces, which sounded very odd to us. Cause we all were like, no way. He was 6.1 pounds at like two appointments ago, which is what they estimated, obviously. But we were like, that doesn't seem right. And then when we got into our room here, they weighed him again. And her scale was saying six pounds, 12 ounces. And she difference. did it twice. <laughs> So she thinks there was something going on with their scale, and he didn't look five pounds to me. So I think that's more accurate. I think he is six pounds, 12 ounces. <laughs> a quick funny shout out to the nurse, the first nurse that held him and handed him to Carlin. We were all guessing what we thought he weighed afterwards. She said, well, I've already technically held him. She said, but I'm gonna guess 6'12". So she's good at her job. She was right on the money. And her doctor said she'd be bragging on me for months. I don't know what I did, but she said I was a great husband in there so score one for me too but you did great thanks babe great support system baby boy's here and healthy i can't believe he's here it's he's so unreal sweet. he's the direct opposite of what he was when he was inside when he was inside he was like a yes crazy dude. moving around like crazy and now like he's just like super just chill yeah back. we are allowed up to four visitors so some of my family's gonna get to come yeah. and meet him here. We asked about Layla, but there's an age limit yeah. still. Yeah, that's sad. So but Layla will see him at home, that's fine. I cannot wait to see Layla with him. When she realizes like this is my baby brother and he never has to leave, it's gonna be cool. I'm gonna get some rest. I'm yeah. falling asleep, sorry. I'm so tired. Well, I guess I can't fall asleep. I could finish feeding him and then I'm gonna fall asleep. <laughs> yeah, you better not. All right, Garland's gonna finish feeding him. Then we're gonna maybe try and get a little rest. So just a quick update for you guys. Mm -hmm.